Uh, 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 uh. Hold on. Oh, Christ. That's probably not right, is it? I probably put them in backwards. Twitch.tv slash MJ. Put them in backwards. Put him in backwards. No, I did not. Why does it sound like that? Holy shit. It sounds it terrible. Sound like that. God. That was probably bad sounding, but I have to figure out why it sounds like that. I have to figure out why it sounds like that. I have to figure out why it sounds like that. Why it like that. Yeah, okay, okay, stop doing the echo thing. I don't know why my microphone does the buzz. I don't know why my microphone does the buzz. Okay. Okay. That's a math homework sheet. <laughs> Hi there. Hi there. It's me, sup, webcam, and all my adoring fans. Uh, it's me, Michael, back again with another video game video stream fuck okay um I play Fallout 76 and I enjoy it a lot and it's fun and the new update just came out so I am going to be checking that out and seeing what's what and I will this is um I got a haircut that's something interesting and cool and neat that I Hap did. That's something. Okay, whatever. Sending an alert to the people. Okay. Uh let's get into the game. So, as I am a Fallout 76 expert and um an idiot, super fan of the entire Fallout series, there are four new things being added to this update. Number 1, the fir the second season of the whatever it's called the st I they don't really have a title for it just the seasons last season was the legendary run and that ended this season armor ace and the power patrol this season and the power patrol it's v it's the ah oh shit I have to lower the volume before I start Okay, they call it the scoreboard now. It used to be called the Legendary Run, which I liked as a general title of all of the seasons. But I guess that's just what season one was called. Because now it is the Armor Ace and... Let me open the live scene. Armor Ace and the... Power Patrol. The 
Okay, that's the last time I wanted to check the auto, probably. It's very red, white, and blue. Um, versus, like, generic communist enemies. But all the, like, all the rewards are, like, based on communist stuff. It's really weird. Like, 90% of the rewards are communist. Even though this is, like, generic USA kind of shit. Anyway, so yeah, I'll be doing that. And then also, so that's added. Um, the One Wasteland update, what the update's titled for, that's been added. Where we will get, if I'm level 50 and my friend is level 25, one enemy on my screen will be around level 50 and on their screen will be around 25 so we can do the same amount of damage while also contributing to the same fight which I'm level 104 which considering the people who binge the game for hours and hours isn't that high but compared to new players it's pretty high so I think I will be fine in the lower level areas cuz they don't they only go up to maximum level 50 and I don't think they'll go that high but in the higher level areas where enemies are is that part of this yeah that's part of this that's wacky anyway um Fuck, what was I thinking? It just fucking distracted me. So, in lo in the higher level areas where enemies are, like, used to be around level 68, I was bad against them already. And now they're gonna be up to level 100? I'm absolutely fucking screwed if I don't... I've started specializing in rifles, but I need to get on that shit if I want to survive... Um, third thing they added, legendary perks, which are perk cards where if you, you can scrap dupl duplicate perks to, and every, uh, it starts 50, 75, 100, 150, 200, 300. At those levels, you unlock a slot to unlock a legendary perk. And I don't know all of the legendary perks, but I know one is like... The equivalent, there's, there's three levels of the lockpicking perk and three levels of the hacking perk. And that one legendary perk is the equivalent of having all three. So I can take a lot of cards out and replace them with this one legendary. And the final thing is daily ops, which is run, which I assume, based on how the rewards are titled, is run by the Brotherhood of Steel, who have returned to the Wasteland... As of, th that was the what the Fortifying Atlas event was for, to build up Atlas Observatory for them. And so, that's over, they're here now, and so we get to meet them. Their new, qu their quest line won't be available until next month, probably, when the Steel Dawn update comes out. But, for now, I'm hoping we can get a little bit of, a, a little... Uh, just seeing how they vibe. I, I read some leaks that they would be helpful, but then the robot reward that you got for doing the event has, like, really harsh lines. I don't know how to say it, really. Where it's, like, it rep- I like the Brotherhood in Fallout 3. If it's something like that- I will vibe with that. If it's something like Elder Maxon from Fallout 4 or the Brotherhood in New Vegas where they hid in bunkers and betrayed each other, I'm, I will hate them immediately. And so I'm trying to go in unbiased because I went into Fallout 4 biased because I played Fallout 3 as a child and that made me dislike the Brotherhood. And so I went into 4 biased and I never did any quests for them and I could have done some quests for them and like gotten more story but I didn't so whatever I'm trying to go in unbiased with this brotherhood but if they are dicks I will 
not like them. So, daily ops. Uh, right, I was talking about daily ops. You do a thing. You go to a location, random locations. There's like five locations. You fight either super mutants, robots, or scorched, I think. They have a random mutation that makes them get to kill them in a certain way, like punching them or with a grenade or explosive or something. And you have to do some tasks, and if you do it in under eight minutes, you get the best reward. I want that best reward! So, um, I mean, fuck it, let's go. I could, I, I write TLDRs of the blog post for my Fallout server. It's not my Fallout server, it's the one I'm in. Um, I do that because I know no one will read the blog posts, because no one, most people in the server don't care about the game. And the people that do aren't going to go to Bethesda's website. I didn't. The only reason I started doing that was because they showed up on Bethesda Launcher. But now I play on Steam Launcher. So I have to actually go to Bethesda's website to write the TLDRs. But I do that. And it gives me something to do. gives me something to write. So I could rant for a hundred years about the update. And everything I've read so far. But... Uh, you're not here for that. You, webcam, are not here for that. You're here for me to play the video game. I got out of club, drama club, like, 15 minutes ago. I was like, I was gonna originally stream this at midnight. But the update didn't come out until 10 a.m. today. So I was like, alright, I'll do it after school. But then I remembered, oh shit, I have drama club today. So I just got out of drama club. This is my first time seeing it. I'm sure a hundred people have already reviewed the update. And are already streaming it. This is my first look. Sorry. There. Daily Ops. Nice. Okay. What am I looking for? I need to get rid of this so I can... Drop some weight. Ooh, ooh. I could do it. But I don't know if I want to yet. Because they say it's good to do it with a team. And I have a team of players I play with. It, they're just not online at this hour. Time to start doing these again. It's been a while. Okay. I should turn off Discord overlay for now. Turn that back on in a bit because I don't want you to see the messages from my friends because I. Mm. Hey, you. Remember to blur that out. It's not like they said anything bad. It's just that I want to keep privacy in this house. Anyway. So we can do the generic things. Um, I don't see any... I should have a couple... Yep, there. I already have a couple unlocked. I think I have three... So I don't want Archer. I don't need Archer at all. So I can scrap that. As for perks, I'm probably going to take a rifle one. I've been taking Rifleman because I have non-automatic, but I, maybe I should take... I'm going to start taking Commando as well so I can switch them out whenever. Let's see this. Ooh-wee. Yeah, okay. And also, you can get the- these look nice. You can get- these slots are available on all characters. Once you unlock them once, you never have to unlock them again. But you have to unlock the cards every single time. Let me see if the hacking one is there. 
auto unlock skill, zero lock, and lock. Three plus lock pick. Yeah, okay. This is the one I want. And I could just. Oh, okay. So perk coins. Uh, I have 50 automatically because you get the achievement or challenge for getting to level 50. But since I'm already level 50, I just have it automatically. I can scrap these and uh, get perk points. So I can get rid of ones I don't want. Which one was I talking about earlier? The Bowman one. Yes. I don't want this. So I'm going to hit F and get two. You'll get double the level it is. So I can unequip with one perk coin whenever I want. Um, what else do I want? That's a nice one. 50% more rounds when crafting ammo. I, I have perks for doing that. That could replace Super Duper. But I don't craft ammo that much. Generate one survival eating cam every 30 minutes. Interesting. That'll be nice for the healers. This one. I'll take this one because I die a lot when in power armor. Because I'm doing those big fights. I could get... I could get this one. And... Get rid of the perk card that gets rid of rads. When I'm in, when it, when it's daytime. So now I can get rid of all of the picklock skills, uh, all of the hack skills, um, people don't want that on in general because people use that, and get rid of sun kissed. Look at all those perks I perk points I have just. Just easy peasy. How much does it cost to rank up? Fifty. Okay. I can I can accept that. I will rank up this one. And now I can just automatically unlock level one and level zeros. And I have a bunch of perk points that I'll fill in later because I know you don't want to watch me fill in perk points for an hour. Also, fast traveling to Foundation and Crater is free now, which is nice. One of the things I saw, I, w I read the entire patch notes and like going over like what they added, what they removed, what they changed. And I was scrolling, 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 got to the very bottom, the very last line. They fix, did they fix nukes? Oh, thank God. There was a glitch where nukes wouldn't drop. The nuke codes wouldn't work at all. And so it became extremely quiet in the wasteland because no one was dropping nukes. Because the codes just didn't work. Um, oh, he's level 50. Oh, shit. They are level 50. Anyway, what was I saying? What was I saying? At the very bottom, last note of the patch notes was they removed the exploit for Line in the Sand, where if you place down your camps, the Scorch will all spawn with, like, not being able to move in midair and drop onto the ground. Because what you would do is you'd place your camps down, your survival tents, 
and the Scorch would all spawn in a small circle, and you'd just throw a hundred grenades in there, and you'd get a bajillion XP, and that was the exploit for a while. And that's what made Line in the Sand so good, and they removed it. Which is a shame. Oh my god, they're level 50. Do you see how little damage I'm doing to them? If Before the update, they would be, like, dead in one hit. I need to just ditch this railway rifle. I wanted to do something fun with it. It's too much work to carry. Okay. 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 Cool. Yeah, nukes are working again. Um, I guess I'll head to Atlas, then. I should join a team first. This used... They changed building team to casual. The reason building was so good was because it would give you more intelligence, which would give you more XP. Let me respawn at his camp. Fine. Um, so they got rid of the old casual, which is like plus luck, I think. And they replaced it with... They renamed the old, the old building team casual because everyone used it. And then in its place of the old casual, they replaced it with daily ops. So you can set up a public team for daily ops and knock them out because, and get extra XP because people in the PTS were doing them alone for a while. And Bethesda was like, hey, you should do them with people. Oh, that's the nuke landing. Okay, I want to hit up this guy's camp. The game is frozen. Dude, dude, there. I want to hit up this guy's camp. And then... And then go to Atlas. I chose his camp because it was pretty close. Thought I could respawn at it. Or fast travel to it. Nope. Just had to... Had to pay. Was allowed. Why were there two explosions? That was weird. Mouse. That's not the game's problem. That's m the computer's problem. I don't know what's up with it, but it does that in all games. It's annoying. When I'm trying to fucking aim in shooters, my mouse goes wee. I hear enemies. Yeah, these rad rats don't need to be level 50. Great. Of course, I'm using a shotgun. The only weapon I haven't, like, put points into. Because it has a lot of ammo. Commander, help! I know you're not my commander ally, but you can still help me shoot them. Thank you. You're not. Just here to purchase something. Three things, actually. Oh, I only have to buy one? Oh. 
That's kind of a shame. For It used to be three, and people would just buy one ammo three times. You know what? I will buy myself some fusion ammo. Just to give them some caps. Give them some money. And then we're going to head on our way. We will have to pass through Mananga. Which is a dangerous town. I haven't explored there much because I am not good. And now the Rad Rats are level 50. They do not need to be level 50. Bethesda, I, I get the... I, I know. I am 100% sure this system will be exploited somehow. I don't know. I have two ideas. I'm using auto walk. I have two ideas. One... The enemies will either be too powerful or they'll be too weak because one player is level 1 and another is level 100 and it'll try and compensate and it'll break and it'll lean more into the level 1 or more into the level 100 and you'll either get... M shut up, shut up, shut up. Anyway, um, there's more, it'll either be super easy enemies to kill that give more XP, or super hard enemies to kill that'll give more loot to the lower level player who isn't supposed to get it because they aren't high enough, but, or th they'll abuse the system, I don't know how, because I am not a game modder, or hacker or abuser or anything I do not I just play for the fuck of it oh Christ needless to say um, this system will be broken somehow I'm a hundred percent sure but besides that they're rats they're big rats but they're still rats I understand super mutants and scorched beasts having that health, but rats, rats do not have to be level 100. Or level 50 or whatever. All these mountains. No, nope, I'm just gonna fast travel. Those mountains are too tall. I, w I hoped I could walk and save some caps. Uh, it's a mountain range. Say cheese. Who's gonna be here? Is it Dorsey? Am I gonna get to talk to Dor? That's a gun. Oh my god. Well, Dorsey isn't here. Neither is anyone else. It's a little interesting. I'd assume they've had a welcome party or something. Also, I don't know why the robots are still here. Also, I don't know how to get in. It's kind of annoying. I, I assumed the Brotherhood were showing up. Because they're the ones... And, uh... I think are running the daily ops and people said they would be assisting people around the wasteland but maybe they're just showing up for Steel Dawn in a month but the whole hype was that they were coming back soon and plus the turret is up and running and like that's not something you would do 
Why is the door boarded off? Well, the doors are all still boarded off, which is not a good sign. And the robots are still here, which is not a good sign. And Dorsey is not here, which is not a good sign. <laughs> hmm. Um. Well. Shit. Okay. I guess I'm not doing anything with them yet. They put up their emblem and everything. You'd think they'd be here. That's gonna be weird whenever someone finishes a quest that pop up. I'm gonna have to read the blog post again. Okay. Oh, there it is. Completed daily op. Complete an event. Heart of the Swamp's hard, though. It's gonna be even harder now. I'm gonna head to this dude. And, uh... I guess I'll see what's up in the blog post, or on Reddit. I'm so dumb. No, it says Steel Dawn is this one, this update. The next update is Fractured Steel. I swear, all these updates are named too confusing. And then there's Broken Steel from Fallout 3. It's, it's a mess, I swear. Point is, Steel Dawn starts this month. And then Fractured Steel starts later. Where are the Brotherhood? Hey. Hey. Hello, sir. How are you? No, I'm just, uh, dumb as fuck. And looking for the Brotherhood. Maybe you should expand shot on screen. Oh, oh. <laughs> uh uh not yeah, I mean, I have, I have the, I have the ones that, uh, I have the ones you gave me. I haven't used them yet, but I have all the perks for them, so I should probably take them. The legendary perk, ooh, that's a good idea, me. So, the, what I'm talking about, the mutations that Blue, the person in the chat, uh, he streams as well, that's pretty, he's pretty good. He's pretty, uh, yeah, whatever. Um, he's good. I'm stumbling all over my fucking words. He gave me some mutations. And they, like, upgraded AP and shit. But they took down strength. So, I didn't want to use them yet. 
because I put all my points in strength to carry garbage, basically. But now I can get the legendary perk. So um, I'm going to cross my fingers. And drink the drinks. And it didn't take down my strength at all. Okay. I figured... Well, I also have... It takes down... It takes down... Strength, but then there's also a perk that reduces how bad it is. Like, how bad the negative things are, like reducing strength. But I didn't think it reduced it completely. I didn't lose any carry weight. I figured I'd lose some. Okay, ignore what I said, I guess. I don't have to compensate with the legendary perk. Back to what I was saying. Where the fuck are the Brotherhood? I would love to know that. I'm going... to the website. Brotherhood. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Blue, I don't know if you're still in or if you saw my message on Discord. They removed the fucking line in the sand exploit. It was the very last line of the patch notes. It was like, uh, new additions, new changes, things they fixed. A very last line, they removed the line of the sand. Uh, exploit. No, I mean, I don't see anything. I am 100% sure they said the Brotherhood is back. That was like one of the main things. A, a new quest line comes with this update, and then Fractured Steel brings the big shit. And yet, they are not at Atlas where they are supposed to be. So... I think I'm just talking to myself again. Um... I mean, I'm just ranting. Uh... Yeah, you didn't come to watch me look at a map. You came to watch me to fight level 500 bees. Jesus! There are some things that it makes sense, but... Th they're bees! I'm looking for an event to go to. Where is the free public event currently? There is none. Start one, please. I'd like to do something. I'm going to go to Foundation.
Okay. Um, we are here at Foundation. I have a quest to photograph Paige and Spruce Knob Lake. And I'll see if there's anything to do around here, I guess. I don't want to start the daily op yet, but I might have to. I'm sure I can do it alone, but they said it would be easier. Okay. Um, uh, ban. Wow, my first uh, chat bot trying to sell me bots, at m sell things. Uh, that's a that's an achievement. Crazy. Good for me. Good for me. I'm famous now because people want to scam me out of my money. I can't even buy subscribers, chatbot. You should know this. I have 12 viewers. I'm not. I have 12 followers. I'm not buying any kind of subscribers. Please load. I was gonna fast roll, but god, it's taking a year and a half to get out of this bunker. So we're gonna go this way. And while I could take a picture of Spruce Knob from anywhere, I have to take it from this location for the quest. How do I get these pictures developed? Because I have to give them to either the raiders or the robot with the overseer, and I'm not giving it to the raiders. But, uh... Do we have... Oh, jeepers. Hey, guys. I did. That was the vantage point. Please. I took the photo. There's a queen. I see her. I took the picture. Oh, jeez. Okay. We're gonna get out of there. Oh, shit. Okay, so. Fuck it. I'll start the daily op. Just to see what it's like. I should probably fix up my weapons first. They're all in pretty critical condition. Except the Tesla rifle. And I don't know what enemies I'm going up against. I could probably check that. I'm clicking on the... There we go. Location birth robots. Ooh, I could I could go in with energy weapons. I have one stim pack. So obviously the good idea is to do it now. Because I want content. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, let's fucking deal with level 8,000 robots, I guess. 
what was the number? 50 plus? Yeah, they're level 50. I'm le no, I have to be level 50 plus. I am. Here's, uh, hope I should probably get in power armor. Should have gotten in power armor before I left, huh? Oh, it's down here. Oh, I've been here a couple times. There's a mission to get to the end of this, and then it's annoying because I can't. Because I'm weak. What am I? Are the enemies from the normal quest line going to be down here as well? Because that's going to be annoying. I only have the... I sure hear some robots. I almost hit F6 to save. That's not a thing I can do down here. Oh, this is a different section of the burrows. This is a different entrance. Come in. This is Dodge. I'm on contact with the uplinks in this area. I'm trusting you to get that resolved. They're iBots. They shouldn't be level 50. Oh yeah, I have a charging Tesla rifle now. Oh, jeeber. I should have come more prepared, probably. The good thing about the Tesla rifle is that it's basically a shotgun where I can shoot wherever the hell I want. And it'll still hurt them. However, they are level 50 now. And I am not that powerful. Oh, right, they have mutations. Fuck. It doesn't make sense how robots have mutations. What's a mutation? I didn't check. Can only be killed by melee. Great, awesome. Maybe I should do the- I don't- I can't hold the power fist with my power armor on. And I'm dead. I'm not getting that top level reward. I was wondering why they were glowing. Okay, I can only kill them by punching them. That's the- That's the game changer for this one. I need to remember that, so I don't do that again. So, we've seen the Brotherhood on comms. That's it. Oh my god, that's so slow. Perfect. There's the connection from the signal repeater. Initiate dodge. Did he jump? What the fuck are you saying, Handy? Those are the ones I've already hurt. Let me kill them. Let me kill them. There, he's dead. And I got eight fusion cells. This is how I'm gonna get the return. This is why I'm using... Energy weapons. Oh, yeah, they also added, uh, they fixed the animation for dying and disintegrating. Which is nice because I'm gonna see that a lot. Yeah, I'm not getting the reward. Which is a shame. But understandable. I, I do not see a way I'm finishing this in eight minutes. I've already wasted like five. Punch. 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 Hit. Punch. Thank you. Ooh, Stimpaks. 
At least they give you something back. Not you! Punch. Okay, what I want to do is vats on the robots and then punch. Okay, yeah, they're being pretty nice with the rewards. Punch! Punch! Did I take down the- oh, I took down the Protectron. I was aiming for the handies. Punch! I mean, I'll kill whoever you want me to. I'm, I don't mind that I kill the Protectron instead of the Handy. That's fine by me. Should have picked up the fusion cells. Didn't. I'm a fool. This is a dead end. Cool. The Burrows also. S oh, this is a Colonel. Great. He's level 75. And they only give me diluted stim packs. Hey guys, has it been eight minutes yet? Let's check the map. Why can't I join it again? I'm in it. You know, it is not bad, actually. I feel like other enemies will be bad, but even though they're level 50, they're not that hard to take down. Their health starts going down a lot faster. I'm not attempting anything. I'm just dying over and over again. Well, if it is robots, then I know exactly what's going to be at the end of this section, then. So, the Tesla rifle, no matter what mode you have on it, if you have the rifle or the stim the shotgun mode, it works like a shotgun where the, where the energy shocks multiple enemies at once. Do a flip. And so, I'm fine with like missing because it'll it'll spread but also I have a mod on it that charges it up and makes it do more damage and I'm not sure how I like it so far I don't see any downsides yet but I feel like it's gonna be doing something weird to the damage it does or something those were just floater grenades floater grenades the most common reward nowadays. Drop from floaters. And also other things. Um, they suck. They don't do any damage. The reason, pe the only reason people keep them is to, they keep the Scorch Beast Queen down on the ground. Because it hurts her limbs. But they sure as shit aren't worth using as grenades. Punch! I hate you. Punch. Punch! Oh, that's a new Protectron. Where's that Robo Brand? I just. Punch! I feel like the higher level enemies are just coming out to meet me. Because I'm not doing the task soon enough. Yeah, see, the, their health jumps down really fast. 
This weapon doesn't do that much damage. Hey, nice. Cool. Glad I have someone on my side to deal with these shitty robots. Punch. 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 I wonder where he is, though. I have the perk that makes rifles better. There he is. But I don't have any perks that make laser weapons any better. So, while this rifle is okay, it's not good against... There, are, I've seen on the subreddit a lot of people who don't know you have to punch them to kill them. And I'm worried this guy might be one of those people. Because people waste a lot of ammo. If you, if you know the rules of the daily ops, you get a bunch of ammo. If you don't know the rules, you will waste a bunch of ammo. So I'm going to see what he does for now. I won't bother him on voice. God damn it. Punch. Right back at you, but from what? Uh oh. I think he's in trouble. Sir, wait up. I'm the one making the content. Unless you're also making content in that case. Good for you. You're doing a lot better than me. Good I don't have to be exact with this gun because I am not good at aiming. Punch! No, I did not mean to throw a grenade! Punch. Why do I hear something explosive happening? Get him. Bam. This man is the definition of get bammed. He's also clearly played more than me. A nice thing about the Tesla rifle, it hits all the enemies because I have... Because it, it goes outwards, which means... I will get the XP for all the enemies he ends up killing because I hit them at least once. Which is not bad. He is not dead yet.
Hey bud, hey bud, hey bud. Okay. No, I understand that. You're busy with the other robots. Oh, right. That trap. Cool. I fell for like a year old trap. Also, I'm in this section of the burrows now. That's not a spawn point normally. Also, there are normally ghouls. There's like a plenty down here. I wonder if they spawn when you come here normally. There's that XP I was asking for. I wasn't asking for it. I was just, you know, blah, blah, blah. Am I in the uplink site? No, it's over there where he is. I assume it's being boosted because he's in it. It wouldn't make much sense to boost just randomly. Hey, I know it's a sewer system, but this place is a fucking maze. Was I on the right? I was on the right side. Now I'm the one boosting the area. Now I'm about to die again. Punch! Ah, oh, crap. Initiate. Give me, give me the report. Initiate. Yeah, see, it's it's run by the Brotherhood. There's no question about that. Where are they? Dying, annoying. Yes, but now I c am away from the enemies. What do you mean, dicier? Is it going to get more dangerous? I don't know exactly where I'm heading, to be honest. This place is confusing. So, I saw a thing on Reddit where someone was like, I left this with double the ammo I just came in with. At the rate I'm going, I'll probably leave with the same or a tiny bit less. Because I sure am not conserving ammo here. That one needs to be punched, sir. Sir, you left one to punch. My reach doesn't reach that far. Did it get its health back? Or were there two of them? Give me a punch. He's powerful.
Yeah, Bethesda was definitely right when they said bring multiple people to this. What do you mean the quest owner? I'm trying to heal. Ooh, that's a lot of them. Ooh, that's my health. Yes, nice. All right. Legendary perks in action. If I'm in power armor, I can get healed. I think there's hostile activity everywhere, sir. You're gonna have to be more specific. Locate the enemy group. Boy, oh boy, I already have. We are in the thick of it. So I got the radiation perk because it gets rid of radiation immediately. But I'm wondering if that fucks with the perk that means when I take radiation, I will heal. Because I haven't been healing as consistently as I used to. I would stand in nuclear waste dumps and heal super quickly. Interesting. Is this new? No, this is not new. But this this was not open. This was the thi this was the first big challenge of the burrows. And if I remember my burrows correctly, it is this way. Oh my god, it's just open. Oh my god, I should have come here after the update. Oh my god. Can you eat? Bite me. I'm trying to activate criticals, but then I jump. It's a real nice pickaxe you have, sir. A lot more powerful than my fusion rifle, it seems. It's an Assaultron! Oh no, it's a sentry bot. Nope, it's an Assaultron. Intimidator. I'm intimidated. What the fuck? It's buff. It's got mini guns for arms. What the shit? Ah, uh, get it, Kilo. I you can't even hear me over the gunfire at this point. Punch. Punch. See a dodge who I still haven't met. All right, yeah, nice. Twenty-two minutes. That was not under sixteen minutes. I will be honest. Ouch. Whoa. Whoa. 10 stims, 15 right, right away, 196 fusion cells? Holy shit. In the, on the webpage, it was saying, like, you'll get fucking floater grenades, which I've already complained about. But... If this is the base reward, and then you get more XP, more legendaries, and more currency, that's... This is... a great way of farming ammo... And loot, and XP, and legendaries. You get, you always get at least one legend. That's great. Holy crap! Ten 
testing. Testing. Okay. God, why is my... Why is web browser Twitch so behind now? Also, why is there a black square on the screen? What is that odd image? I don't have a Steam alert anymore. Why did I spawn here? I swear I left off, I don't remember at this point. Okay, interesting, cool, neat. What to now? Searching on the Reddit quickly. Alright, that's. John anyway. Just don't hear. It says I didn't search for. I I searched for Brotherhood. month ago, seven days ago, eleven days ago. Wow, it would be nice if they sorted these in order. Okay, I'm gonna uh, ask a question on the subreddit and then I'm gonna get back in. Building is town boarded up. Okay, you didn't want to see me type that, but then you did. Sorry. Um, oh fuck, dailies. I have to start doing dailies again. Level up, build floor wall decorations, complete an event. I heard an event pop up. I didn't see what it was.
Uh, fuck the events. Fuck events. I, I'm tired of looking for events. Real blast. Okay, never mind. Ignore what I just said. Everything I just uh, said shit about events. Let's do it. On my way to do real blast. Because that's my favorite event that I have to pay for. Because I get to explode things. Fortifying Atlas is the name of the event. I couldn't remember it. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. What's up there? Oh yeah, the Vox Interpretator shit. No, thank you. Oh cool, uh, 60 Yaogwai. So, obviously the weapon, the enemies are higher level now, which makes them scary. But I feel a tiny bit stronger. Not strong enough where I'd... I am not going to be good against these level 60s. But I feel like my guns took down the robots a lot faster than I would have before the update. So I feel like they have not only brought the enemies up, but brought up damage up. Of course, I could be wrong about that, and I'm just a fool, and I'm getting absolutely torn to shreds right now. But, you know, that's something we have to learn in the pursuit of learning. Yeah, let the Yao Guai kill the Scorched, and I'll get the score for them. BAM! That barely did anything, okay. I think I missed. See, I could go fix that or I could wait until another one breaks. And then fix them both. Hey, fight the bear, not me. Right, I was going to... I was gonna... Today was going to be... Half-Life until the update. And I was like, nope, I just have to do it. It's not like there's a... It's not... There's nothing crazy new except the... The Daily Ops, which we've already experienced once. In, um... Not amazing results. But, um... Oh my god, I'm barely doing anything. My critical did something, though. That was nice. Like, I... S oh my... A hundred?! I'm literally doing no damage, but then I do a lot of damage. Um, I'm one, like, the first, like, 20 shots are nothing. They're dog. And then after that, I start doing regular, like, pre-update amounts of damage again. And I'm wondering if the, the bar isn't exhibiting that properly, or if that's a thing that happens now. And if that's a glitch or a feature, because it seems like it, the thing resets every time I enter VATS where I shoot him a bunch, and then I start doing real damage, and then I enter VATS and I shoot him, and then I start doing no damage again. Oh shit. Also, um, as cool as the... I have 17 stim bags, that's so nice. 
As um As nice as the daily ops are for looting and XP and everything, I the only thing they've added so far is the uplink task, which I already exhibited. And I think there's four different maps, um, and one of them is Vault 94, and you can explore Vault 94 now, which Vault 94 was part of the Vault Raids, where you went in the vault and you fought, like, level 90 enemies, and that was back when I was, like, level 30, so I was not good against them. But, um, it was really grindy, apparently. You wasted a lot of XP in it, so they got rid of it when Nuclear Winter came out. But they've reopened the vault just for the daily ops, but you can also explore them whenever you want. Which is pretty neat, because I never got to look around that place, and I want to get the lore. That's a interesting. Nice. Okay, one, 250 more. Any of the dailies. Okay. Level up. Kill a legendary. Build war of blah, 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 blah. Complete daily operation daily challenges. Is that a thing? What are daily operation daily challenges? Interesting. Is there a close... Where am I here? There's a close thing that isn't one of the power plants. Because the power plants are a bitch to take over. I do not see one. That one's already taken. That one's already taken. These are really high level as they are. You know what? I will, I'll take over the Red Rocket Station and then I'll explore Vault 94 a little bit. Because I never got to do that. And now I am prepared to do that. Also, I wonder, I didn't get to, I didn't check, I, I forgot to check, but I wonder if daily ops disable regular challenges like Nuclear Winter mode does. Because Nuclear Winter, when you're in Nuclear Winter, obviously, um, you don't get the challenges like kill five enemies in Nuclear Winter. Or like, uh, do a certain amount of damage. You don't get those, you only get the ones that start with Nuclear Winter. So I wonder if they're if daily ops disable all of them except daily ops or if you can still do the others cuz it'd be a shame if it disabled all of them because then none of the robots i killed counted towards the i just heard something loud none of the robots i killed counted towards the killed creatures challenge and none of the creatures will I see a friendly on the map. I doubt it's going to be friendly for long. Just ignore me. Just ignore me. Fuck. I will be on my way, sir. Let me just murk these robots. When I thought, I, when I said daily challenges would break, or, uh, this system would break, I didn't think it would be weird damage. I thought it would be something different, but, you know, I can't say I'm super shocked. Also, I haven't been checking in the top corner when it says how much damage I do with crits. I don't think it tells you, actually. 
but they said uh, things like crits and sneak attacks wouldn't be counted in multiplication anymore, like, uh, but instead with uh, addition, which I don't know what, there was weird wording, but what I assume that means is instead of doing two times multiplier, it'll say you did 30 more damage, and it'll add that onto your total. But I don't know. That's a monkey. I thought that was a person. God, I'm going insane. Okay, let me claim this. Look around. I would like the lead, actually, sir. I don't use 38, I use 308. Okay, and now I need to make wall decorations or floor decorations. So presents for everyone. Presents! There we go. All right, I'm I'm level level two. I unlocked a thing. Whoa! No, never mind. I thought I went up twice. Oh, I'm I'm very I'm like this close to hitting the next level. That daily op one, whatever it means. I assume it's just a rename of the daily challenge one, and I'm wondering if that was a bug or a feature. But that was a nice jump. 1,000. <sighs> the fact that they're dailies means I have to get in daily, which is a little annoying. Because I have to log on every day, and I have to do my challenges. And sometimes it's tedious to get on every day, especially now that school started back up. But, you know, what can you do when you're trying to be the very best that no one ever was? The very best that there ever... Fuck. Bum, 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 bum. I don't want to defend it. Hey, robots, we're back. Sorry to burst your fucking bubble. Okay, so I went across that bridge and it wasn't the right way, so I assume this way? Punch! Punch! Marsupial. So I have all the. I didn't actually check what the mutations did. I I I should have, but uh, I didn't. I checked a while ago, so I know that they're safe. Now that the strength didn't affect me, I know they do good stuff for what a, how I want to play. But I mutate the mutation marsupial. Makes you jump super high. And I really want that because I want to jump super high. I said I didn't need it, but getting Speed Demon, the one where it makes you faster, 
So nice. I'm coming. I'm trying. I'm lost. And they are behind me. I've hit sprint about six times. Punch! Oh my god. Jesus. Oh, I accidentally drank that shit. Punch! I am getting... It is very wet in this section. Which is a weird thing to say. I'm definitely getting more out of this one than I got out of the last one. That's a good thing. Punch! God, I wish I could punch freehand. Or I wish I could rifle butt with my gun in VATS. You can't do that. Just gonna ignore those guys, run the fuck past them. My sprint key is running again, which is nice. Turn this way, this way, which way is this way? That way. So I wonder if these areas are like specific for instances. Not instances, daily ops. Like if I came back here without the daily op active would I get would the door be reattached or would it still be blown off are you kidding how did I miss the man I wouldn't say I'm getting two times the ammo from these enemies, like the guy on Reddit said he was, but I'm definitely getting more this time. I'm not going to retake Red Rocket. Hey, 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 wait, 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 wait. Let me get some damage in on it. Punch it. I don't know what challenge I completed to get me that. Fuck. So close. Oh shit, I didn't look at my rewards. Do I, can I reopen that menu or am I done?
I am done. Okay. Fuck. That sucks. <coughs> oh my god, Rob. I know he can't hear me. I'm not talking to him directly. Rob was one of the... Oh my god, I got so much more ammo. Rob was one of the viewers on the st on Blue's stream. Blue Asai. I should mention. I He was in my chat earlier. But I never actually spelled out his name. Lowercase Blue. Capital A S S E G A I. He's a cool dude. Um, one of his viewers is named Rob, or I don't know if he's a viewer, or if he was just someone who turned in that day. But Rob is in my team now, and if you look at that little number, it's not that little actually. It's um, it's a thousand and two. Level one thousand and two. How do people do that? I feel with daily challenges and daily ops, I will get loot a lot faster than I did last season because of the daily op challenges. I still feel it's going to be a pain in the ass to level up at later points, but for now I feel like the daily ops will boost me ahead of the game. Because I got like a thousand from that one. I guess we're just exploring now. Now that the uh, god awful robots aren't here. Or the. not robot schools. Pastor Salvador and the first residents arrived around noon just as the radiation started climbing. I tried throwing some tarps over the sensors to tamp them down, but the failsafe stripped around 1.30 and the vault door locked down. The other bus didn't make it till 3. There was nothing I could do. The system's hardwired to lock out the controls until the end of the shelter period. Everyone's in shock. Sal... Sal... Salaver? Salaver? It's like Salvador, but Salaver. Blames me. I think... They all do. God, I can still hear them pounding outside the door. Oops. Pastor asked me to take charge of the office up here, set up proper recep reception desk. Took me a couple days to get the place cleaned up, install the lockers for a weapons check, but I think it's all in order now. Not expecting any visitors for a couple of weeks, but you never know. In the meantime, I've got plenty of time to do crosswords. First visitor showed up a little before noon today, right on schedule. Rough looking bunch. Things must be real bad out there. They wanted to know who was in charge, so I sent them to meet with the council. They blew right through the weapons check. Shame after all the work I went to set up the lockers. Okay, so this vault was open... Like... A year after the bombs dropped. No wonder... They... There are so many plants. Alert notification. Uh, detected multiple compliance and had issues declaring an emergency. Blah, 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 blah. The resolution is to leave the vault. Which is not a good thing to do when the vault is supposed to save you. I don't want to really read that. Hmm. Are these the lockers that you set up so well? I've never had time to take pictures in here because 
I only went once and the ghouls were beating my ass. Uh oh! Speaking of enemies... Hard shells. What was that danger noise? I really don't want to waste more fusion ammo, but I am... Oh, I took a minigun, didn't I? Shouldn't have taken the fucking minigun. No. Ooh, a deathclaw gauntlet. Not bad, but I do have a assassin's power fist, and it is better. Yeah, I don't need the heavy stuff. I guess I'll sort through that late later. Hey. Crap. That's what I was going to say, but then never said it. My weapons are pretty low, except for my... My Tesla rifle is probably low now, too. Considering I've been using it all stream. So yeah, they're level 75, but I'm still taking them down pretty quickly. So I feel like I've also been boosted in damage. I've already said this, but it seems like official. Like I feel like I can say for a fact, I am stronger. I don't know if it's because of the legendary perks or the the change in how fighting works, but I'm a lot stronger and it's nice because now I can work on what I need to work on. Oh, an agriculture wing. I'm sure nothing went wrong there. I hear them. I hear them. Oh. Where are they? Very nice looking vault. Uh, I don't like the Deathclaw or the M Myrler King or whatever I just saw. And there it is again, the warning sound. I really don't like that. I hear something whirring up, like a minigun or turrets, and then nothing comes. God, I was I had one stim pack when I started this stream. Now I have like 40 just from two daily ops. Oh yeah, that's nice. Bam. 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 It wasn't the king or deathclaw, it was a hunter. This is my least powerful gun. But it, I have a lot of ammo for it. Oh shit, there's a king as well.
I'm also probably surviving because I'm wearing power armor. Because boy oh boy, if I wasn't, I would be ripped apart immediately. I just wanted to explore the council. Interesting. Does not look like they did well. Oh, it's a hundred. It's level 100. Great. Awesome. Guess I'm not getting that box of loot. Can't see how this section went wrong. Now, what kind of seed bank? The seed bank where you save plants for a hundred years? Or the other one? I assume the first one because this is a plant infested vault. I would actually like to take my leave, please, if you don't mind. Ooh, this is a nice place. I think this was in one of the teaser shots. My big ass power fingers look stupid holding this camera. Can I do something? Can I kill them? No, I cannot. Time to leave. Time to leave. Time to leave. Now, my Tesla rifle is not even that hurt after two ops. I guess I didn't contribute as much in the second one as I did the first. There was this hole in the wall. That lead back to where I was. Cool. Also, I've gone through like two and a half fusing cores. It's not great. The fact I have five of them. That's a little uh, shameful. How long have I been going? I feel like I've been going a bit. I started at like 3.20. It's 4.48 now. We're gonna let me get out of the power armor. And let me take my time. Take my time. My strength is 290. Why is that? Oh. Fuck. It seems like the mutations had a slowed effect. Hmm. That's an issue. Because I carry 300 pounds at the minimum. Um. How long have I been going? Almost two hours. Cool. That's an issue for me to solve another day. That being probably tonight. I'm gonna have to... I think the agenda is to figure out which one of these I don't want. Take out the perk. Get rid of all of these. Because basically what happens is you have a perk that's holding these in even though I have no radiation. If I get rid of that perk, it'll get rid of all of them. Um... Which sucks. Um, so I'll have to figure out which of them I want to get rid of. I shouldn't have taken them both at the same time, probably. But... 
and then I'll find I'll just have to rebuy them and they're pricey but people really resell them for less so thank you for watching good seeing you people who came in and then my webcam for the rest of it I'll see you later when I see you um bye